You and I have company coming over. Who? Grandma? My boss is coming over. Mr. Gibbs! Call me Brandon. You looking lovely as usual. It's a really big promotion, and I need him to know that I'm the woman for the job, okay? What's up, y'all? Boy, take those glasses off. Uh huh, do, fella. So, it's your Brandon. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. Your hands are really soft. Thank you. But I'm more of a hugger, you know, so. Uh, okay, okay. Salt. Where's the salt? I don't see it. Where's the salt? Where's the salt? See, it's not like nobody in my kitchen. I know Amaria moved the salt. What's this meal? Trying to burn the house down? No, no. Take this and fan that fire alarm. <sighs> Not burnt. Why are you cooking so much anyways? You and I have company coming over. Who? Grandma? No, not your grandma. Then who? Your only friend is dad, and he out of town. Shut it. I do have friends. I was very popular in high school, for your information. Now, where's the salt? The salt's right there. It wasn't there before. Listen, my boss is coming over. I need you to be on your best behavior. It's a really big promotion and I need him to know that I'm the woman for the job, okay? Ma, I'm 15. Best behavior? Yes, because you act like you're 10. Plus, he's bringing his daughter over, so I need you to be on your best behavior. She fine? See, that's what I'm talking about. Go upstairs and get changed. She gotta be fine. There. Now that's perfect. Boy, why are you coming in here looking like Soldier Boy mixtape? What you mean? Gotta get five for the ladies, you know? She make it clap, clap, clap. Make it clap, clap, clap your way back upstairs. This is not a music video. This is my boss and his daughter. Plus, I think they kind of bougie bougie, so. Should have said that then. They're already here. Okay. Lord, please help this dinner go good. I really need this promotion so I can get my Tesla finally and stunt and be right here with my hood rat friends. Mr. Gibbs. Call me Brandon. You looking lovely as usual. Well, thank you. Who do we have here? My name is Jari, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Your house is stupendous. Wow, stupendous. Look at you, such great vocabulary. Come on in. Well, Cece, this food looks very tasteful. I can't wait to indulge. Thanks, I put my foot in it. It really smells amazing. Thanks, Jari. Well, well, it looks like we're missing the person. Yes, um, my son will be joining us. Omarion, oh, get down here! See, Jara, I told you you'll make new friends. I love new friends. What's up, y'all? Boy, take those glasses off. Ain't no son in here. Mr. Gibbs, this is my son, Omarion. Oh, How do, fella? Uh, Brandon. So, it's your Brandon. Oh, okay. Oh. Sorry, I didn't see you there. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, the name is Omarion, but you can call me, not Julio. Nice to meet you, I'm Omarion, I'm not Julio. Your hands are really soft. Thank you. But I'm more of a hugger, you know, so. Get up. Uh, okay, okay, that would be quite enough. Omarion, son, sit down. For sure, for sure, for sure. So, Brandon, thank you so much for coming. I thought. It will be a phenomenal time to talk about the promotion over a hot meal. Okay, I would love that. Okay, let me grab some wine. Well, well, actually, I don't drink in front of my daughter, so if we can go in the kitchen, 
and we can have a glass and we can discuss business in there before we indulge in this beautiful feast that you've prepared. That's perfect. Right this way. Omarion, be a good host. Of course. Alright, how right, are they going? How about we get to know each other? Yes, I want to know you inside and out. I would love that. All you have to do is hand me that knife and I can carve off the top of your skull like I'm peeling an apple. I hear that the human mind can still function when exposed to the outside world. Much different from cats. Poor Scuffles. <laughs> snuffles, what, what, what happened to Snuffles? Ooh, I still want my food, I'm still hungry. No, please don't leave me. What's wrong? Yeah, Marion, what's wrong? I'd hate for her to keep father waiting and miss out on a great opportunity. Marion, spit it out, what's wrong? Oh, n nothing, you, you, you can go. You sure? Yeah, you can go. So, I'm not Julio. Wanna have a little fun? <laughs> as long as it don't involve knives. Not many people understand me, Marion. Do you know how lonely that can get? I just want a friend. <laughs> you know friends don't eat friends, right? Who said I was going to eat you? I just want to harvest your organs and sell them on Amazon. Okay. So, what's been going on in here? <laughs> Mom, she crazy. We get the promotion. Her dad in on it. They're trying to eat us. What? What's going on? Omarion, oh, sit down. Mom, telling the truth. She don't need to be around no knives. She said she's going to pin me like an apple. What? Um, maybe we should discuss this at another time. We should leave. No, 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 no. Everything was just getting started. Everything's fine. We we'll be all right. Are you okay, Sugar Paul? Yes, Father. I think Omarion had his moment, but I'm sure we can all find it in our hearts to forgive him for his See, outburst. she's so sweet. Sweet? Mom, you trying to murder me and you call her sweet? We've been watching a lot of scary movies this week, right? So that's what's got him a little shaken up. Oh, he's afraid of the dark. That explains a lot. Yeah, that's right. Right, Omarion? I need this promotion. You need to tighten up. Get it right. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Now, I apologize. Sorry. I can't hear you. I said I'm sorry. For? For saying this girl's was seconds away from killing me with that knife on the table. All right, now let's sit down. Let's dive into this food that I slaved so hard over. Oh, look, dinner was so lovely. I'm strongly considering you for that promotion. Thank you, I truly appreciate it. Jari, it was a pleasure to meet you. Trust me, the pleasure is mine. And it was nice meeting you, Omarion, I'm not Julio. <laughs> Same. Oh. I'm a hugger. <laughs> Can't wait to carve you like a pumpkin. Okay. We definitely have to do this again sometime. Yeah, well, that sounds like a double date. Sounds like a plan. See you later. Do we really have to invite them over again? You think I'm gonna let that creepy child back in my house? What? You knew? Any child that used the word stupendous is creepy. So you thought I was crazy? Wait, huh? Let me tell y'all a thing of three. It's pronounced K-N-E-G-R-A. Now subscribe. <laughs> I crack myself up. Thanks for watching, because watching me is better than watching TV.